My name is Phyllis Tolliver, and I was born up in Boomerhalla, up in West Virginia. And uh, uh, we came from Boomer. Well, our house was slipping off the hill, so we had to move on down to the next uh, area, which was Harewood. And we moved in with an uncle. He had about five rooms, and he had two children, and it was 13 of us. So we stayed there as long as we could. Then. We moved on down to Long Acre, the next little town, and we lived in two houses there. And the boys lived in one, the girls lived in the other, and we finally made it to um, Charleston. And uh, I think uh, I always tell my grandkids, and they laugh at me when I tell them my biggest toy was the commode, because we had never had one. <laughs> <They> said, <laughs> when uh, the church uh, was started, up on Washington Street in uh, uh, 1979, I think. And uh, um, it was mainly family people who started. It was uh, uh, the Tollivers and the Pages and their children. And uh, um, Reverend Stone was the pastor there. And we received a lot of help from the Bible Center in uh, Charleston. And uh, um, we realized then, I mean, I realized then that uh, it was a church where you carried your Bible and you carried that Bible all the time. And even uh, I like to have pencil and paper with me, but uh, that's that we know that we're going to get the Word of God. To me, I know that uh, the Word of God is preached here. And we have people who are loving and caring, and we have a caring pastor. And I just, uh, I don't want to miss, you know, I, if I'm out of town, I really miss my church and, uh, and the people around us. And um, with this pandemic, some of our people haven't returned, and we certainly miss them. But uh, we certainly, uh, you know, I just feel that there's love and care here at this church.